to lose your time. If you have ever met Chef Henry Chandler, you know that he has a larger than life personality, but you may not realize he has a very serious side as well. And as Fox 5's Buck Lanford is here to tell us, tonight is a special night for Chef Henry. Now, you know Chef Henry oh, he comes in here, he has the place in stitches and the food, oh, of course. Yes. Hmm. Delicious. Yeah, you may remember Chef Henry from some of the cooking segments that he's done right here with us on Good Day Atlanta. His food is great, as we said, and he's always enjoyed life, but it was a life-changing event six years ago that made the owner of Henry's Louisiana Grill in Ackworth cherish every day. Shake it a little bit, make sure the crawfish are looking good in it. Boom, boom, boom. Henry Chandler loves his job. Every third person that comes in this restaurant loves to eat. Ooh la la. And he loves life. I've never throttled back any. You know, I ride Harleys, I hunt, I fish, and I, like I said, I have been wide open my whole life. But the gregarious owner of Henry's Louisiana Grill in downtown Ackworth, who describes himself as a good Louisiana boy, Les Bontemps Roulet. Even from a redneck, I can say that. <laughs> Has an appreciation for life as well. In 2008, he wasn't feeling well, and what he thought was the flu or fatigue turned out to be much more serious. He had liver cancer, a diagnosis that floored the Chandler family. That day was uh, the worst shock of our life. Henry needed a liver transplant. After aggressive treatment and a lot of prayer, just getting on the transplant recipient list was a huge victory, but Henry's battle was far from over. This I lasted about 11 days, and on September 1st, basically, uh, I was given last rites. That was it, you know. Uh, there was no liver in sight for me. There was not going to be a transplant because there was no liver ava readily available for me. Uh, and uh, that was it. I was going to last about another 24 hours, and I was going to be gone. And uh, that's where the power of prayer comes in. That's where the, that's where the true meaning of all these people, all over the world, family, my kids, everybody praying that it's going to happen. And that is, that's what it's all about. And despite the prayers and his faith, when Henry closed his eyes that night, he thought it was for the last time on this earth. When I went to sleep, everybody was crying and moaning and hollering. When I woke up, everybody was happy and cheering and everything. And then that morning, a liver had come in to the, uh, through George Transplant and through God to me. And I was given, a, I, I was put on, that day as the day I was transplanted, September 2nd of 08. I was given, an, I was given a second chance. And now, six years later, he is still making the most of it. A chafalaya catfish. That is going to be the best thing you have ever eaten in your life besides the ooh -la, la He likes to say he's 55 years old, but his liver is only 27. So uh, I've been blessed. My liver likes me, uh, and I like my liver a lot. So it's been a, uh, it's been a good run for us so far, and I mean, I think it'll continue to be. And tonight at Henry's Louisiana Grill, they'll celebrate at his annual Liverversary celebration to give thanks, have fun, and most importantly, raise a lot of money for the Georgia Transplant Foundation. I mean, it, life is, uh, you know, it, we look at it as every day is, an, it, is something that you can celebrate. Celebrate life, you know. Don't sit on your butt. Get out and do something. Get enjoy yourself. And, of course, Henry is thankful to all of his friends and family for their support and their prayers through the years, but most of all to his wife of 25 years, Claudia. He calls her the anchor, saying without her, he would not be here today. Uh, she kept up the Caring Bridge side and kept people informed and, and really was by his side throughout the whole ordeal. For more information about tonight's fifth annual Liverversary celebration at Henry's Louisiana Grill in Ackworth, and to find out how you can help the Georgia Transplant Foundation, follow the links that you will find on our website, myfoxatlanta.com. Here's you think I, you know somebody, you know? But here's the thing. It's not that he got a second chance at life. He immediately paid it forward. I mean, mm -hmm. he could have told the Transplant Foundation, thank you very much, move on with his life. He turned it right back around just to make sure someone else now has, has a chance. Absolutely. He's very involved, of course, with the Liverversary. And also, if you're not going to Liverversary tonight, if you just go to the restaurant, 15% of all the proceeds from tonight's just regular, uh, you know, people that eat at the restaurant will also go toward Liverversary. So he continues to pay it forward and he's involved in a lot of other, you know, charity work around the uh, Transplant Foundation. And he can cook too. Oh Ooh. man, oh man, don't he get his, goodness, he don't he he get get the <laughs> Le Bon Ton You taught me how to say that. So uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Teach me now. That'd be well, nice. Well, All right. Thanks, you head out there and have some dinner, I think. I can do that. <laughs> All right.